Hey guys, if you have been looking for a way to create your own online store on Flutterwave, I'm in this video I'm going to show you how you can create your own amazing online store, something like this. So it took me less than 20 minutes to create something like this. Uh, and you can also create your own. And that 20 minutes is because I was doing other things too. So I'm going to show you how you can create something as amazing as this. So, so that you, you can send traffic or send your customers to this page so that they can buy. Let's see that they can buy your products. Just add one so and buy it here. Then pay you. So they pay you, put their details, then they place your place order and you can fulfill it without having to program anything. Yes, I mean it. You don't need to program anything. Just put your product online there, send your customers there, let them pay and you ship the product to them. That's it. You just make your own box. All right, if you are new to this channel, click on the subscribe button below. Also turn on the notification so that whenever I uh, upload amazing content like this, you'll be the first to know. All right, let's get right into it. So the first thing you need to do before you can do all this, you need to have, have uh, an account with Flora Wave, Flutter Wave. I've done a, vi a video before on how to create an account with Flutter Wave. So, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to create your own store. So uh, for the video, on how to create your account on flutter wave i will leave the description in the link below and you should also see it at the top of this video so ch you check the link in the description below for that video on how to create uh an account on flutter wave so after creating your account here is what you come to so when you log in this this is your dashboard so the first thing you do is to go to store here store we just click on this store so it will bring it will bring you to this page so let's set up a store so so remember we are trying to create something like this something like this something like this okay something like this as beautiful as this so i'm going to show you how you can create your own without knowing any programming without spending money on domain or any websites just everything is done for you on flutter wave which is very very amazing so you click on set up my store so you name your store so let's say so this name is the name that will show up here so this name is name that will show up here so let's use something amazing let's use baby products i don't know why i'm using baby products uh <laughs> maybe it's because I, I i like babies so all, all right store description you put something that your customers we can relate with okay let's put all things baby okay so your store url that's what we show for, uh, that's what we show here so, something like this you can see this that's what you'll be sharing with your your your, your customers you can see flutterwave.com slash store slash amw group so you can name your own so you can put the store name uh, in this case it will now be flutterwave.com slash store slash pitch hq12 so let's use something cool <coughs> sorry about that so let's use baby okay baby what yes that's very cool so let's use baby word here so that our store will be branded baby word baby word so probably you have seen online store image just put upload it, an image we will have created an image but here yeah, let me just use um you can use anything baby let's use uh, the picture of this thing here so you can pull that so you just click on upload but you can use your your what's it called your look your logo here so just put it there select category since you are dealing with baby products just click on that then click on complete setup slug already in use please pass a unix slug value that means i think okay i think this this has been used this is what they call slug that is this baby word baby word okay let's put ph that is pitch baby word so it doesn't really matter uh, what really matter is the link you are going to be sharing with your customer so our store has been created successfully so what we need to do is to add product to the store that is all these products you are seeing here this ones this ones. so you add it so and i'm going to show you how to also add this uh price pricing here so what you need to do your store uh you need to create uh, several products let's say we want to create something like baby bed okay let's put the product name is baby bed okay so baby bed bed so uh, baby bed okay so here yeah, the description is what they will see at the bottom you can see mini size baby bed so you can put the description 
you can say um comfortable comfortable something that would draw the attention of your clients to click on that particular product comfortable mini size mini size baby bed okay so you put the amount so this price here this particular price is the price you are willing to sell to them so let's say you want to sell your own for eighteen thousand. so but this price here is the price is the price here like the one i the the, the strike through here is the one that will be here so it's the one that will be here so the one they strike through so so you just make it higher than what is here so let's say is let's put this one as twenty six thousand. That means this will show the customer that they are getting bargain. So that means this twenty six thousand will be strike through just the way this forty thousand has been. So that's what we are doing here. So we put the weight. Let's say for for baby bed, it should not be more than uh, one point five or this one is in kilogram. So just the weight you can just estimate. So it's zero one point five kilogram. So then number of items in stock you put the number of item you have in stock so let's say is a uh, 15 so select category so you just select the category so now we don't have any category yet so what we need to do is to create new category so let's call it a uh, baby products baby products so this category we allow okay we allow you to save all your uh all similar products under the same place so then you have size and option if you that's if you have multiple size of this particular product you can just keep that so the 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 most important thing here is to put an image that is something like this that people will see you can see that so just put an image since you are talking about baby beds you can go to google download the uh, uh uh pictures on baby beds download pictures on baby bed so this is one let's use this one and we have it here so just upload it okay it's uploaded so you can upload as much as much picture as you want so you can upload as more picture as you want so let's say you add <clears throat> okay let's find another baby bed picture or if you can get something okay um, so you can upload maybe two pictures or three pictures for the same one but it will be the same bed don't let us don't let us click that one so it will be the same bed showing them different angle of the picture since we are using this let's look for something that's similar so you can just put uh maybe you have another color let's use this it's kind of looking the same but not not really the same so you get the, the point here is that we should use the same like the uh different this one facing front this one is sideward you can use this one facing the other side so just something that will show that it's still the same product or, or you can just use one image so in this case we only use one image so but let's use two two here so we're trying to design our store so let's use two so just put two so i'm going to show you i'm going to show you the result of everything so you, you can add as many images as you want but let's leave it like that save products you click on save products so our product has been created so if you want to see the way this thing looks like just go to manage store manage store here click on manage store you can see this link to your new store it's offline you can see just click on take your store online so that anybody that clicks or you can see the store is now online so that anybody you give this link will be able to uh, access the web page that is your store online just click on that you see it will take us to a new page as you can see ph baby word yes you can see ph baby word something something like that so that if we want to go to the home page for the store so you can see this is the only product we have that's why so uh we'll change we'll add more products so that we can have something like this something a bit as amazing as, like this so let's go back to our dashboard just go back to products so click on add new products so just let's say what else do we have here let's create we are creating something like this baby trolley so let's create baby trolley just to be fast so uh baby trolley 
um, let's put lightweight baby trolley. So you have to put something that that's very enticing because anybody that needs a baby trolley, I don't know. <laughs> so they will need something that's not too heavy that can be easily push push around. So price, you put the price. Don't don't forget, you put the price you are willing to sell here, and you put the uh, other price that will be in strike through here. So let's put um, baby trolley. How much can that cost? Let's put um, twenty five thousand. We are willing to sell for twenty five thousand. Then this one, let's say thirty thousand. So then let's put the weight at uh, one point two. Just type one point two. Then put zero. Sorry, zero to, to fill that up. So a number of items in stock. Maybe you have hundred available for people to buy. So select category. Let's just put a still baby products. Just click on done. So uh, let's leave that one. So the next thing is for us to select image. So this is baby trolley. Let's look for image. So you can go to Google to download your own image. Just click on that in this case let's use just one image one image so that you can save time on this video so you can use as many images as you want save products save products so you can see the product has been added so we have zero of hundred so we still have hundred in stock so let's reload our page you will see that there will be two okay sorry baby word let's load let's reload the page so you can see so there are two items here the first one was the baby bed we created the other one is baby trolley so uh let's create more products so this is how your home page will look like you can see trollwave.com uh slash store slash ph baby word so this is the link you'll be sharing with people to assess your store so you can create as many products as you want let's create uh one more let's create one more so let's call it uh, let's check this out ampa okay let's call it ampa so let's call it ampa ampa so let's call it all things ampa all things ampa so let's say ampa is around we can get ampa for around 20000 you can put uh, let's say this one is a uh, that's that's 30,000 30,000 so the weight let's say um, 0 0.8 let's just put 0 0.8 so let's put um we have 10 of this let's say we have 10 of this so that's the amount that's the total number you have in stock so let's see okay category let's create another category create new category let's call it general 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 products okay so you, in essence you are creating your own jumia and conga website without having to pay any money to anybody just creating a free flutter wave account and you can click on the link in the description below to create your own account so let's choose this image of empire so you will have downloaded all images you need <coughs> or you snap it yourself if you have the image on your phone or on your system so just go to save products Go to save products so you see now let's reload this page you will have seen that the 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 amper will have okay now yes here we have it so any customer that sees this will say wow they are they are doing they are reducing ten thousand error for me so sometimes you might decide to say okay they have free delivery you can instead of putting all things amper here in the description all things amper you can okay click on it so instead of putting all things amper here you can just put uh let me go back to home instead of putting all things empire you can just put free delivery nationwide here as a description so that anybody that clicks on it so let's add one okay you don't want to click on it and see more so you don't need to do all the all this yourself so since you put everything under the description uh, and you inserted every uh details of the products there so the customer will be able to see so you can see they can just add plus one let's say plus two okay let's say two items just go to cart you can see that two items so it it, it it just sum it itself you don't need to do any work flutter wave has done everything for you so the customer will put their name let's say the customer will put their name if they have coupon you can also create discount coupon for your customers but let's let's not make this a uh, video too complex so just click on place order that's how the customer will place order and they will make payments for your products and you receive it in your 
uh, Flora Wave dashboard here. You see the it's under transactions. So that's basically how to create your Flutter Wave store. So if you are new to this channel, click on the subscribe button below. Also give this video a thumbs up so that others who are looking for amazing content like this, we see it. All right. Thank you very much. And I'll see you in the next video.